and Lighthouse Kids. This is Haisa. I'm going to read from the book called The Ology, and the story is called Adopted. Imagine what it might be like for an orphan with no mother or father or brothers or sisters to be adopted into a large family. Think of the day when her new dad sweeps her up into his arms and gives her a big hug that says, I'm never going to leave you or let you go, and I'm never going to let anyone take you away from me. The next day, the new daughter is introduced to the rest of her new family. There are three other children, all adopted like her, ready to welcome her with smiles, hugs, and laughter. <laughs> What a difference it makes to be part of a family. The moment a person believes in Jesus, God adopts them into his big family. This is why Christians are called God's children. It is also why we call God our Father when we pray and why we call other Christians our brothers and sisters. Not only that, God gives us the power to become like Jesus and grow to love him and other people. Instead of always thinking about ourselves and trying to get our own way, God changes us into his own dear sons and daughters who love him with our whole hearts. But to all who did receive him, who believed in his name, he gave the right to become children of God. John 1:12. See what kind of love the Father has given to us, that we should be called children of God, and so we are. 1 John 3, verse 1. Let's pray. Dear God, thank you for loving us and adopting us as your children. Thank you for this wonderful family called church. Help us build each other up as we grow in love for you, Father. Amen.